Okay, uh, welcome back to my channel. I was going through my closet yesterday and I found uh, these pairs of uh, these pair of boots. Uh, these are uh, black harness boots, as you can see. And I have uh, had them since 2008. So these boots are 14 years old and I have never cleaned them or polished them or done anything to them. So um, I did wear them pre uh, very much from uh, 2008 until uh, 2015 maybe. So it's uh, I have been wearing them a lot for seven years. And as you can see here, a lot of scuffs. And uh, you can see the heel is uh, going all the way down here. So I, I need to get them resold. At least it's the back piece just uh, needs uh, to be replaced. Because the rest of it, it's, uh, it's okay. Um, these are Boule boots made in Canada. I'm not sure if you can see that, but uh, made in Canada, Boulay, and I think this is the model number uh, 3009. Okay, um, I'm going to use uh, saddle soap today, and uh, tomorrow uh, when they are dry, I'm going to apply some. Uh, just some uh, leather fat or something like that, uh, or some kind of oil. Uh, and uh, the funny thing is, these boots are 14 years old and the leather is not uh, dry at all. It's uh, really soft, no cracks. I'm just going to clean them quick and I um, don't mind to, you know, Underneath this harness here, I don't mind. I just uh, do a quick um, do a quick uh, cleaning and conditioning because, uh, as you can see, they are holding up pretty good, and I have never done anything to them. I haven't even uh, uh, brushed them or anything. So uh, I'm just going to just wipe them off here with uh, I soak this in water. Just a, real quick before I am um, using the saddle soap here. Okay. So uh, as you can see, um, these have never been treated uh, with anything, and they are holding up pretty good so and I have worn them a lot but for the next uh, the last few years I haven't, haven't worn them at all so I took some cell soap I have not the same as I used on my uh, on my uh, Iron Rangers but um, this is a different kind of uh, saddle soap that I uh, just put in a little bit of uh, warm water and just took a, a little bit of saddle soap on that. So I'm just going to do this really quick. Nothing fancy. And uh, I'm curious to see how this puts uh, will look when they are clean so, so I'm looking forward to see that tomorrow and uh, the other pair uh, of boots I did clean last week or two weeks ago I don't remember but uh, that was my uh, Red Wing Iron Rangers and that video have uh, got a lot of views so I really appreciate that because uh, I think that's cool. And up here, uh, I 
even have a toothbrush today, so. Just to get down in here in the welt. Uh, Boulet boots are made in uh, Canada. Uh, I don't know so much about it, but uh, they are making harness boots and mainly cowboy boots, maybe work boots, I'm not sure. But uh, maybe you guys know because I don't. So I um, think that's good enough. I don't care to do so much up here because, uh, yeah, I don't care, actually. <laughs> so here's the other boot, as you can see. They are holding up pretty well, so. Do the same thing to these boots. And as I said before, that uh, you have to do a lot of things wrong because many people have opinions when it comes to clean boots and say uh, either this or that is totally wrong and you ruin your boots and so on. But you should do a lot of wrong things to uh, literally ruin your boots because uh, they can handle a lot more than you think so that's what they are made to do okay you can buy in really cheap uh, sneakers and they can last you for several years and if you buy some expensive high quality leather boots And you just take a little bit care of them, you have boots for a long, long time. And uh, it's like I said before, it's, uh, the worst thing you can do is not to treat your boots at all. So as long as you are doing something, have come a long way okay I think this is uh, enough okay now I'm going to just wipe them off a little bit and the boots have to be totally dry before I uh, apply any conditioner on them. So and uh, I bought this boot because I think they looked uh, cool and I uh, had uh, never owned a pair of harness boots before so that's the main reason why I bought them I don't have a motorcycle or anything like that but uh, I just like this style of boots so so little close-up shots here this will dry so you can see now they even look better just from cleaning them with the saddle soap and and so on. As you can see here, these boots have a pull strap that uh, did come off on this boot. So, but I just going to wear this boot until the, they are no more. So. And that could take uh, many more years so i hope you guys uh, like and subscribe to my channel and i will keep you posted tomorrow on this uh, boule harness boots thanks for watching bye bye